Yo, 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 what's up YouTube world? Today, I am gonna do my top 10 greatest fighters of all time. Yeah, in order. You like my jacket? I'm popping out in a minute and I thought I'd do this video because I'm up, I'm amped up for this video right now. You know what I'm saying? Right, number one, I've got my list here. Right, number one, top of the list, in my opinion, Jack Dempsey. Jack Dempsey is at the top of the list because he was he was super, super, super tough. Super tough. He had this perseverance, this iron will. You know what I mean? When he used to go into the ring, he just wanted to destroy people. Just had this hunger, like he was hungry all the time. And he was really hungry all the time. Sometimes he used to go without food for two, three days. So he literally had to fight to stay alive. Number two on my list. So if I'm looking down, it's because I've got a list here, man. I can't remember everything, bro. Sugar, Ray Robinson. He has to be. Really, that could have went either way. He could have been at the top of the list as well. Because Sugar Ray Robinson was extremely skilled. And there was a point, I think there was a point, if I recollect, he was like 91 on one. Never lost a fight. Incredible fighter. Incredible super middleweight. Or middleweight. Right? Number three, Muhammad Ali. What can we say about Muhammad Ali? Everything's been said. Amazing entertainer, amazing human being, knows how to conduct himself, knows how to talk and articulate, extremely funny, very intelligent, very charismatic, and an amazing boxer. Number four, it's got to be the baddest man on the planet, baby. Mike Iron Mike Tyson, badass. We don't need to say nothing about Mike, man. We all love Mike. We all love Mike. And to be honest with you, best version of Mike, right, when he was 20, the best version of him, to be honest with you, in my opinion, is very, very hard to beat by any of these fighters. You know, this guy could easily take the top spot. Right, that was number four. Number five, Willie Pep. Featherweight. Mate, featherweight. This guy, how many fights they used to have, and they used to fight on a really, really regular basis. This guy, halfway through his career, he fought with one eye blind. Imagine that, mate. Imagine that. That's super tough. Right. One of my most favourite fighters of all time. To be honest with you, any of these fights could be top, man. Depending on the best day. I'm, I'm just doing it justice. They could all, in my eyes, they're all top. Roy Jones Jr. Super skilled. This is, is one of the most exciting fighters to watch. Skill levels just off the charts. You know what I'm saying? If this guy was a natural heavyweight, right, and he had them attributes... He'd give Mike and Tyson a run for his money. Well, at, even though at one point, right, he was, he, the odds were 10 to 1 or something like that to beat Mike Tyson because of his skill levels. Just unbelievable. Right, that was number six. Remember, look, I ain't rehearsed none of this. I haven't rehearsed any of this. I'm just doing it. So if I do things wrong, I'll do things wrong. You know what I'm saying? We, we learn as we go, right? Sugar Ray Leonard, oh mate, the four horsemen of that era. Hagler, Hearns, Roberto Duran, Sugar Ray Robinson. What an era, man. What incredible fighters they were. But Sugar Ray Leonard, whoo, mate, that guy, even in the amateurs, he used to knock out people. Oh mate, he used to send people out on stretches, man. He leap you with like eight punch combinations. Like, brrr, bang, you're on a stretch of your out. Unbelievable fighter. Fantastic human being as well. Really like Sugar Ray Leonard. Roberto Duran, what can we say about him, man? The hands of stones, baby. This man will just eye in anyone out. He can just go all day long. Super, super, super tough. I like Roberto. And after him, no, Roberto's number eight. Sugar's. Sugar Ray Leonard's number seven. Manny Pacquiao's number nine. 
We all got to love Manny, man. Super tough, super tough. Come up from a straw weight or something like that. Something stupid. You couldn't even make the straw weight, man. They had to put weights up in this geezer, man, to make that straw weight. Ain't that unbelievable, man? Unbelievable. Phenomenal fight. I loved him. Extremely enjoyed all his fights. Right? Manny Pacquiao went up multiple divisions and become world champion. You know what I mean? He done things that were just phenomenal. And at number 10... And this guy is not going to like this, right? He's at number 10. He ain't going to like it. And he does think he's the greatest because his ego is just through the roof. It's Floyd, Money, Mayweather. Man, listen, hate him or love him. Me, personally, I love Floyd, the way he comes across. He's amazing. He's, he's an amazing boxer. I love his style, the way he boxes. Phenomenal finesse, speed, timing, defense. Everything's on point. Money, women. Cars. This man's got it all, man. You know what I'm saying? He's the ultimate showman. Great showman. I love Floyd. Right, that's my top 10. Number one, Jack Dempsey. Number two, Sugar Ray Robinson. Number three, Muhammad Ali. Number four, Mike Tyson. Number five, Willie Pep. Number six, Roy Jones Jr. Number seven, Sugar Ray Leonard. Number eight, Roberto Duran. Number nine, Manny Pacquiao. Number 10, Floyd, Money, Mayweather. Okay, that's my, that's my top 10, man. Come on, comment down below if anyone's going to comment, man. Comment down below and you tell me what's your top 10. Who's the greatest fighter of all time? Come on, man. Leave it out. Right. Time to go and do some work. Time to go and earn some money. Then go to the gym later on and smash it in the gym. We've got things to do. Uh, you got to get up. you got to get up early. For me, it's a bit late. I've already been to work. I've done my job. I've come back. I've have gone to a doctor's appointment, I've come back. Now I've got to go to another job and do some job. And when I come back, I've got to go to the gym. Manager's busy, 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 baby. you just got to keep yourself busy. You've got to keep moving. So, like I say, I'm going to leave you. How, how am I going to leave you? I'm going to leave you like this. God bless you all. Be safe and be kind.